si sus múltiples responsabilidades personales y profesionales le impiden seguir una carrera universitaria, ahora es su oportunidad. Estudie desde la comodidad de su hogar y en horarios que se ajusten a usted y su tiempo. Clases las 24 horas del día, 365 días al año. Nuestras clases son 100% a través del Internet. Tenemos programas de 2 y 4 años y también maestrías y doctorado. Visite nuestra página web o llámenos hoy al 305-448-7454. She simply picked up, picked up the phone and said, I'm handling your first fundraiser. I'm doing it. I'm going to talk about you as well. Um, and with people like that around me, uh, I know that on August 26th of next year, uh, I'm going to have not candidate, but Judge Ruiz. Yeah. <laughs> I guess the biggest question that I get is why I want to be a judge, and I think that almost everybody in this room has been in a situation where um, your case is on page 52, and you have the interpreter, and you have your client, and the judge is going page by page, and there's nobody in front of you. And by the time they get to page 49, you lost the interpreter, and so you have to go back to the line. I, I can do better. I, I know that I can do better because I've been there. Um, I've been present in court when uh, judges have embarrassed and humiliated attorneys, public defenders who are doing their very best. Um, I just experienced that a couple months ago and uh, an assistant state attorney who's been with the office probably 30 years and I were standing next to each other and we're just, you know, shaking our heads. It's unnecessary and I know that I can do better. Um, and that's basically why I feel like we all deserve uh, just to be listened when we write a motion and we believe in it. At least give me a little bit of hope that it could possibly be granted. Um, when we know that it's automatically going to be denied, then I think that justice is not served. And, it, you know, I don't think that things should be that way. So that's why I want to be a judge. I've been doing this for almost 17 years, and I've had a very warm reception. Um, if Gila Mendez can tell me you'll make a great judge, then I think, I think I'm in, in good shape. And that's it. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Teresa de Leon is someone I've known for almost probably 30 years, and she offered to um, host this here at, she's the director of this school. Um, Carmen Vizcaíno also uh, worked on this, and Julianne Hogan, who's not here because she lives God knows where. So I just wanted to uh, thank them. Thank you. I want to remind you, uh, please sign in so that we know who is here. Uh, we want to make sure that we keep track of who our supporters are, and we're happy to have your presence, but we're also happy to have your money. So. <laughs> 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 